Now, this next story might sound a bit out of this world, but stay with us. A Guernsey man could be amongst the first person ever to live on Mars. Yes, you did hear me right. Ben to Jersey Moore has beaten hundreds of thousands of applicants to make the shortlist for a one-way space adventure. The privately funded Mars One project aims to establish a human settlement on the planet in 2025. Penny Elderfield takes up this cosmic story. These indeed were tense and dramatic moments as the lunar module came into land. We've made it this far and made history doing it. This was the moon as it had never been seen before. But there's another planet mankind's got its sights on, Mars. A four billion pound project could see the first people not just land here, but live here. And this man could be one of them. How does it feel actually watching this video and knowing that you're one step closer to actually going there? Well, it adds to the impact. Now I've got to start asking myself how I'm going to deal with, you know, separation from family and friends and everything I love on Earth. Because I don't dislike the homeworld. That's not why I'm leaving or hoping to leave. Uh, it's because I want to go to Mars. Being able to inspire thousands, millions, possibly billions of people if I'm successful is really quite humbling. Out of 200,000 applicants, Ben's already made it to the short list of 1,000 to be part of this project to establish the first colony here by 2023, with 20 people living self-sufficiently. But if Ben makes the cut, he also has to face cutting most ties with home, and the reality, it's a one-way ticket. We'll be able to send video messages and stuff, so it's not like we've died or anything. Well, hopefully it won't be, but uh, it is a risky project. A rigorous selection process of medicals and simulations will take another year, at which point Ben will find out if he's one step closer to his new home, 40 million miles away. Penny Elderfield, BBC Channel Islands News, Guernsey. Good on you, Ben. Thanks for talking to us.